Jonathan Harris, a man who has an English accent and it's from New York. A brilliant actor who loved class, he listened to the opera. So did Guy Williams, this the opera. I think Jonathan Harris knew every operatic uh, that was ever written. Um, genius in timing, delivery, his memory was outrageous. He's the one that had a pad, of, a pad of, and a pencil beside his bed. And if he woke up at night, or when he woke up in the morning, if he thought of a name to call the robot, he'd write it down. He thought of all the names for the robot. In fact, it would say, Smith calls the robot so and so and so, and then would blank, blank, blank. Just, nobody knew what he was going to call me. I never knew until he did. He thought of all those wonderful uh, sayings, bubble-headed booby and all of those things, that made it personable for the fans to reflect his feelings about the robot. Um, he worked with Bill Dana you know, as a hotel ma uh, manager. He worked in the uh, series The Thin Man with Michael Rennie. Um, he did so many, many movies. Uh, Botany Bay, going back to that motion picture with Alan Ladd. I think he was the only one that Alan Ladd uh, uh, didn't have to worry about putting him into a, uh, a gutter to make Alan look taller. But he, he was so good. He was so good that when you worked in a scene, you knew you were in a scene with a great actor, and he's going to make you look even better. So that's what we had there. That's what we had.